Hey guys, welcome to another edition game and I uh, <clears throat> got a package in the mail here from Amazon, so get right into it. So we have uh, here's the front of the box. There's the back of the box. So I gotta get my exacto knife out. <coughs> so you with me in a minute. Sorry about that. Did not know if I was need an exact enough or not. But so um, trying to keep this in view for you guys as much as I can. Set this aside. We have the rule book here. Um, very detailed rule book here. And goes into all the details. Do all right. Now we have the punch board, so we have the resources, and uh, the first builder bonus tiles, and it says attention, do not throw away the empty punch boards, so we're not going to do that anyways, so I'll punch these all out, that's um, one of them, that's two, That's the third board and the final board. And I will punch these out because there's not a whole bunch of content to punch out. Anywho, and I just want to make sure we get everything punched out because when we get to the other part of the game, I'm going to need to do this anyways. Each of these boards are going to get put away into the box. And it doesn't take long to punch out this stuff. But these look really cool. Um, they're really detailed. So I like the fact they actually at least tell you not to throw these things out. Because I think I know why they don't want you throwing these out. It's probably to make the box compact. So that everything fits. So. And uh, punching out all of this stuff is probably going to be the easiest thing I've ever punched out. So. And the reason for punching these out is I want to put everything away. And everything goes into the storage. Tuners. Yeah, I got this uh, from a the Amazon gift card uh, for doing uh, some surveys. So I had some gift cards, so I used them, which is cool. Whoa. Yeah, so right now I'm making sure I have all the pieces punched out. I'm going to put these off to the side. Yeah, we got straw, wood, bricks. That's what these are. 
and I think I'm supposed to save this one as well. If I don't need it to save it, then that'll, because this one doesn't have that thing on it, but I'm assuming this is considered a punch board, so punch card, cardboard. So I'm gonna save it, and if I don't need this particular one, then we'll move on. All right, let me make sure you get Everything's punched out. Put these off to the side. All right, bring back the box. <clears throat> All right. Now we have the miniatures. So this is the game trays. They give you game trays, which is kind of nice. So we have the pigs in here. So I'm going to try to show you guys. The sculpts are really good. Really detailed. Uh, I'm trying to see if you guys can see it or not. I don't know. It's hard to... Then you got the big bad wolf. And everything fits in here. And then you got the other pig. They're all different colors. And they all go with their player boards, so. Okay. So there's that. And that's good. Bye bye. Then we have the trays, and that's where you put your resources in. There. So you got these trays here. So everything gets sorted out. So we have the book here, which is the first player marker. And then you got the the roof for the brick houses and the foundation for the brick houses. So you can do that, that, and then uh, the brick houses here. You do and there's a completed house. So each spot's got parts for everything. So that goes there, goes there. Then you got the foundate the and then you got the roof for the the wood house, you got the roof. I don't know if it, it can only go one way, right? Yeah, pretty much. And you got the... Then you... And then of course you have the straw. So those are those. So that's what these trays are for keeping all your stuff. So all the resources are gonna actually go in here. So you can put like this one. You can use all, all like the fives, and then this the other tray you can use the ones. And you have a die. I think that's for the solo, a solo variant or something, maybe. Uh, then you got the, the dragon, the giant, the troll bridge, the troll. and then you got a couple more of these wolves card uh, characters. So there's different wolves in the game. And then we have the other components for the game. So it's kind of a lengthy video. And I know there is a really spot. There we go. I like when you do that. So yeah, these are your fable cards and friend cards. So you got friend, 
cards here, and your Fable cards. So, so your Fable cards, you got like the Roar, it says, before collecting resources, all opponents who share your location shuffle all of their gather cards, and randomly select one, and move to that location. So it's, these are ways you can Uh, when reveal, play in a location stays in play until discarded. It says end of gather fate. All players not in this location must discard one resource of their choice. Discard royal wedding if no players are in this location. So this is one of those that keeps going, can keep going on. So they got all these different um, cards you can play on your opponents, and these are just do different things. So I mean, the artwork on this game is re oh, really amazing uh, artwork. So there's you got the wolf. I think there's also the big bad wolf. Yeah, and then you got friend cards. You got Aladdin, Alibaba, Cinderella, Evil Queen, the Apple from Snow White, Fairy Godmother, which is from all different ones, the Frog Prince, Hansel and Gretel. This one does Hungry. Build phrase: All opponents' walls cost one extra resource to build. They must give you, they must give the re that resource to you. So that's kind of cool. So yeah, they got like little different abilities. I'm not gonna go through all these ones. And you got Pinocchio, who mu who can lie or tell the truth. If he if he lies, he gets nothing. Tells the truth where he's going, he gets some resources. I'm planning on doing my stuff here. All right. Just gotta find the tear spot. It's right there. There we go. Okay, so these are all fable cards. There's tons of fable cards in this one. All right. A friendly game. I mean, so this there's ah there's a big bad wolf. Big Bad Wolf. He's uh, end of gather phase. All players at the Big Bad Wolf's location must destroy one straw or wood house section of your choice. So obviously he's pretty nasty. So he's gonna blow your house down, no matter what it is. Yeah, this is probably one of the longer unboxing videos I did, but there's a lot of stuff to unbox. Alright, this one's not coming off. So my exacto knife is gonna just be a little bit more of a system. And of course you got the little red riding hood. Rumple Stiltskin, a whole bunch of characters. These are oh the gingerbread man. So there's tons of cards here. Druid City Games advertisements. Alright. The player aid cards, which always are helpful. And we got gather cards for each player. So you got the purple player, or you got the orange, gold, the green, and the blue. So yeah, these just basically you secretly pick your location where you go, and that's how you pick. So it's kind of nice how they do that. And we got some more friend cards. 
Okay, so these are the friends. And then this one's uh, the marching ants. <clears throat> so let's see, we got, I'm pretty sure we got everything we need in here. Yeah, I'm just gonna sleeve these. And then, and they probably won't fit back in the box, but I'll figure out a way to do it. And, um, doo -doo -doo -doo. That's everything. So, we're going to start by putting in these things here. And if there's spots underneath, the other spots. So, there's that. I don't think I need the other one. Let's see. No, probably not. Okay. So, for right now, Friend cards go right there. They're not going to be good. They're not going to stay sleeved. Fable. And the gather cards. And I'll figure out how to keep them in here. So apparently, this one I don't think I need right now. With the resources, so I put all the ones. Yeah, this is the tedious part right now. But the cool thing is, once these are, you can just leave them in the tray. Oops, leave them in the trays. And then I'll have to make sure all of them are here. Let me just get the wood. But they all should be here because I didn't I cut them all on the table. So this part won't take as long to uh, to do. Just to pick all the pieces up and uh, put them away. We're pretty good with uh, the only problem is if they ever make expansions for this, nothing's going to fit in it. So. Let's make sure everything is picked up. There's that, there's that. So now we got the player boards put in here. So. Alright, so. these it doesn't matter where they go that way it fits nice and neat there and 
So we got the rule book. And that's everything you need to know. <laughs>